hey guys welcome back to my channel it's marisa so in today's video we are doing the midnight muses deluxe or lux box for Samhain or halloween and the um theme is honoring the morgan and there she is right there and if you're hearing a little clippity clappity of claws we just got a new addition to the family we have a new dog and her name is pretty girl and yeah so i'm sorry if you hear little noises in the background like squeaking or, or clippity clappity of nails but that is our new doggy and i'm filming in a new spot so it's nice and high up so anyway i'm gonna stop yapping and let's roll the intro and let's get into this beautiful beautiful box into this box this is not the perfect setup it's not the perfect angles but we're gonna make it work I'm gonna do my best so of course actually on top are these um, sheets where it's gonna tell where the um, what's in the box but uh, let's not look at that yet so I'm gonna put that to the side okay and then of course ooh, nice so let's see if i can get beautiful she's beautiful i do have some earrings um honoring the morgan and i don't know a ton about her like i'm learning every day so here is the beautiful art print their box is really some of my favorite and here is another art print for your book of shadows or if you want to hang um, it up in your home and here's a beautiful crow and it talks about Samhain All right Here are some things Communicating with spirit honoring ancestors divination and scrying and protection magic and you have de deities you could um, If you ah, there's my carriage wind right there. So that's beautiful Baba Yaga Kali, Morrigan, Hecate. So that's wonderful. So these are all of the things you could do on Samhain and it gives a little history. All right. You hear the doggy in the background? All right, so over here, we have usually it's like an oracle or tarot card that has been intuitively picked. Oh, wow. Okay, so that I'm assuming is the back. Oh no, okay, so um I don't know what card that is. Two of swords. I don't know, wands, I don't know. But anyway, this is beautiful. I'm not sure what card that is. I guess that's the back. And that is the front. That's awesome. Just the artwork is beautiful. Like, you know, you don't have to have meaning for it. Um, I'm gonna put her right there for now. I'm sorry this angle is not the best, but I'm really doing my best. So off the bat, the first item we have is this beautiful feather. Absolutely beautiful. You can use this um, when you're cleansing your home and you're like uh, burning sage or smoke or whatever. Um, you can use this to direct it. Sorry, the doggy is making noise, but you know, we're, it's basically her, whoops, her first full day here. So we're all getting used to each other. All right, now let's go through the box. And we have Vervain is our herb. Now, this company, um, Sugar Muses, has a Sugar Muses box, which is like the deluxe box. And then they have the Sugar, uh, excuse me, the Midnight Muses deluxe. And they have the smaller Midnight Muses. I believe the smaller one was the newest one they added. So, and honestly, you get 
beautiful, beautiful items in there as well. Alright, I'm gonna move some of this stuff. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, wow. We got three herbs. How awesome. And we have some white oak bark. I love... I actually use a lot of roots and bark in my workings. And we have some mugwort. Wonderful. A lot of these are good for divination. You, you know, to kind of get the mood and the clear your space and um, just like it's good to connect if you want to connect to your ancestors if you want to connect to spirit uh, I think these are wonderful herbs you can use all right now what do we got here Ooh, cool wow nice so we got two hand rolled black beeswax candles beautiful absolutely beautiful love it all right pretty girl you're gonna hear a lot of that me saying that so let's move some of this out of the way she's very interested in what i'm doing so what do we have here this is probably an oil and I'm telling you now, her oils, I think her name is Christy. Um, her oils are the best. I, I don't want to hear it. Uh, no matter what company I get oils from. Yes. Oh, I'm so excited. Morgan. And the late, I mean, just the packaging is always so beautiful. I mean really it's just gorgeous so let's smell and it's always like a roll-on well it's not always a roll-on but usually these tall ones are roll on oh my god all right so you could connect with the morrigan and it's smells scent burning herbs really helps you connect with your intention um if you want to work with your ancestors if you just want to give like an offering it's the the smell and the smoke really really helps you connect i just want to see real quick what is in this oil if i could find it okay and that tarot deck is called dark a tarot of dark angels so just if anyone wants to know that, and it's by Luca Russo. Uh, oil, oil. Can I see the oil? Do, 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 do. I can't see it. Why can't I see? Ethically sourced feather. Okay, here it is. Um, contains dark night blooming floral extracts, vanilla absolute, black pepper, clove, vevitor, and sandalwood essential oils. And it is in an almond oil base. All right. I just always like to know, because I always tell you guys, oh, it smells great. And you're like, I don't know what's in it. I can't smell it. So, so we have a beautiful, like kind of an olive green satin bag and as usual you can use these to oh my goodness this is gorgeous uh you can use these for spell bags mojo bags whatever your path is wow that is beautiful all right gorgeous let's see put that over there so you can maybe see it so this is what we have so far. All right, I'm gonna get a scissor and I will be right. Oh, the, I can never pronounce this right, but that's what that stone is. <coughs> Raw, pre-night, pre-high, I'm gonna say that wrong, but I actually love this. I have some in like a spell bag. It's almost like a sleep. I, I put it under my pillow 
mixed with selenite and lavender. And I'm gonna tell you right now, it really works. I have very more vivid dreams using the selenite and this beautiful stone. All right, let's open up this black box. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Ooh. Ooh, we have a necklace. Very pretty. Beautiful. Now, can we can we know what the heck this is? Hmm. Well, I may oh, it's black tourmaline. Yep. It's a black tourmaline pendant. And Okay, so this pendant carries the energy of determination, confidence, and resilience. That is lovely. Um, that was her intention maybe to put in here, or maybe it is part of also uh, what this um, stone can bring you. But um, you can also put your own intention. Um, black, a lot of black stones are good for protection, but I really, really like this intention of determination confidence and resilience because i actually have to go back to work after a very long time of not working so i'm gonna wear this a lot um and see if that helps i think that's beautiful okay and we have this is an artemisa bundle um let's see do, 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 do. Uh, the oak, the mugwort, yeah. Well, I read it here. Yeah, ethic, no. Uh, yes. Ethically sourced Artemisa, oh man, why? It's called Desert, Desert Artemisa. So, this is to cleanse and to bring in some wonderful energies. Let's smell. Lovely. Very, very nice. That's so beautiful. So far, this is what we have. And the doggy is just sitting near me. And she's being really, really good. She's great around everyone except for other animals, which is not good. Because we have a lot of dogs in our neighborhood. All right. So here we have a set of uh, candle holders for our beautiful black candles. This is wonderful. Now I'm gonna put these on my main altar because I have a Hecate altar and it's pretty filled up, it's much smaller. So I wanted some beautiful stuff for Samhain. Um, yeah, so this is wonderful, I love it, that's perfect. All right, actually let's put these in here so you can see, all right. Okay, so I'm gonna open up one package and I think one little more thing and I think that's it, but I'll be right back. I'm gonna open that up so it's not too noisy. So we have two more items and I was, we have some patchouli, incense. I love patchouli. Okay, and I have some burning. It smells wonderful, and I am so excited if the two beautiful candles, the art prints, the necklace, the three herbs, the crystal, um, the candle holders was not enough, and the oil, which is, oh my god, I have been looking at these on Etsy, um, and I was like, wow, these are really, really cool. Look at this beauty right here. Now, I don't think this is real bone. I That could be very, very expensive. It could be resin, and it feels like resin, but... Um, and I can't find it on here, but that's okay. But I'm assuming it's resin because getting, like uh real bone and stuff i saw some on etsy um you know with engravings and stuff like that or painted they could be very very expensive 
but this is so awesome and I'm assuming this is like a Ravens um, you know to go with the Morgan now the Morgan has many many different ways she's like a very multifaceted um, goddess um, with a lot of attributes um, so I actually I believe have a audio book about the Morgan um, she's very very interesting uh, I listened to it quite some time ago but I would suggest if you're just interested you don't have to work with her I don't work with her um, I think she's just very interesting and I, I love learning about you know new and interesting things so she's really cool wow this box blows me away so I just want to read this one little uh, thing here um, actually so how ha it's Halloween all hallow even all hallows Eve all Saints Eve and Samhain are just a few names given to celebrations occurring on October 31st which we all know and Samhain begins at dusk on October 35th 1st doy and is uh, the Celtic New Year New Year's Eve also known as the witch's new year yes so in this month's box we honor the morrigan who is closely associated with the underworld i am sorry about just so many things today we got a another uh ambulance uh hello new york every every video uh <clears throat> who is closely associated with the underworld and the season of Samhain. And I'm just going to read this part, and then I'm going to shut my mouth. All right, working with the Morgan. Sometimes it feels like we are getting up each morning and going into battle, doesn't it? Whether it be facing a challenging job environment, <clears throat> an unruly teenager, that's funny, or facing a more sinister situation like dealing with jealous social media friends. All right, whatever. Uh, the Morgan can... Uh, bestow confidence, provide creative strategies to deal with conflicts, and offer protection. I like that. So, that is it, guys. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. There's an invocation. There's Legends of the Crow. There's a lot of information on here. And you can also use the back. Um, you know, if you, if you choose to. Sometimes I do that. Um, I use, you know, depending... Um, I'd like to save some information. Um, yeah, so, but that is it. I am sorry about the setup today. I did my best. I think it went okay. And the doggy was pretty good. Um, but yeah, thank you so much, guys, for watching today. I hope you enjoyed. And I wish everyone the most blessed Samhain. All Hallows Eve, Halloween, and I really suggest you look into the Morrigan because it's so much, but she is so really wonderful and interesting, and she's absolutely beautiful. She's basically a badass bitch, really. I love her. Uh, <laughs> but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you are new here, I would love it if you subscribed to my channel. That would mean a lot to me. And that is it, guys. I love you. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.